Pastor Vicki, did Jesus die for our sins? That is a line that the church has used for hundreds of years that does not really make sense to me. Jesus died because Jesus challenged the status quo and the leaders of the church at the time and the leaders of the Roman Empire were not happy with his challenges to love one another, to treat all fairly and to welcome the most marginalized in the community. That is why Jesus died. He was killed by those who feared him. What on earth? Vicki is stripping away the beauty from the gospel. In order to come to her conclusion about Jesus' death, you need to deny so much scripture. I'm wondering if she's even opened the Bible recently. She says Jesus dying for your sin has never really made sense to her. I would think that would be just like step one of like trying to become a pastor. Like, do you know why Jesus died on the cross? Um, but let me try to make it make sense to you. A lot of people just think about Jesus as a troublemaker. He came to break the rules to give rights to women, to look at the minorities and say, lift them up. Like he was just kind of an activist type guy. Uh, Jesus was so much more than that. He was God in the flesh and he declared that multiple times. Jesus' mission was a lot more than just disrupting the status quo. He was coming into a spiritual battle to win us back from sin and death. In Jesus dying on the cross, he not only fulfilled all those prophecies, of the Old Testament, but he made a path, a way that we could find reconciliation with God. You see, a lot of people like Vicky will try to convince you that Jesus just came as an example. Oh, this is what it looks like to love people. This is how we should be. That is all why Jesus came. He just came to set an example for us. But here's the thing. None of us can measure up to Jesus' example. Jesus was perfect. We cannot be. We cannot be a good enough person to measure up to earn God's favor. And that is precisely why Jesus came. You see, without the bad news of sin and judgment, we don't really understand or grasp the good news of grace and Jesus dying on the cross and forgiveness. Vicki is trying to strip away the beauty from the gospel, and I would encourage you to not believe her. Follow for more Christ-centered content and help support my ministry on Patreon.